All right. So we just defeat a Serenator. Scholar turned slave. They tortured him. Took him with them on their raids. Drove him to madness. Spreading this new form of darkness to new worlds. To my world. I feel like that shouldn't be closed. I think I'm supposed to go back where I came from. Yeah, well, let me go back up here. Pretty weird I can walk like through that door that's closed, but you know. It's whatever. Why not go through there? Might be able to go back up through that building. Oh, maybe it's their hair. between the Northmen and the darkness. His tales of hell were true. Then that was the source of it. She learned everything she could from him. Until she too could see what he saw. tell this story. Before the Earth was created, there was a world called Muspel. Because it was in the south, it was bright and hot, flaming, burning. Sparks that flew out from Muspel became the stars. Other sparks melted ice in the frozen world of Niflheim, creating the body of the first giant, Emir. Muspel is one of the nine worlds, and is now the land of the fire giants. And people from elsewhere cannot endure a journey there. Okay. I walked down there. I don't think I uh, got that rain before. things. I don't think this is the way back. Remember right, I came up. I'm trying to remember the way back. Because <sighs> they told me to only defeat two bosses until I can go to Helheim. Fairly positive that's what happened. Is this where I just was? Might have been that other door I had to take. Yeah, this is where I just came from.
her hair. I honestly feel like I'm going in a bunch of circles right now. I did go in a circle. Okay, I came from this way. find the way out of this area. So it's not this door, and that door also leads back over there. I'm guessing it's over this way. From here? Not sure. There was another way to go over here if I go back and go back onto that bridge. So that's what I'm gonna go do. Or do I go under? Go back up and oh, I'm just double checking. I think I know where it wanted me to go, I think I just, like, went off somewhere else. <laughs> After the fight is when you come across that bridge. Oh, if I go down here, that just brings me back over to... Uh, brought me back down to the area with the houses. It did not. Does it want me to go?
focus, but... Not working now. Also don't know where it wants me to go. <clears throat> Looks like I'm this way though. Fairly positive this is a new area. Have you ever died before? It's a serious question. When the illusion of self is shattered, you simply cease to be. Though it may not seem that way to others. I don't know where I am. You know when it is true. You can feel it. A stranger in your own body. An imposter. And nothing is the same ever again. Senua has died before. And she will do so again. You can be sure of that. Back at the doors. With the mark of Valraven and the mark of Sirtis, you may cross the bridge over the river of knives to Helheim. The Northmen say that in the beginning there was nothing but darkness. Bitter cold to the north, fiery hot to the south. They say the cold formed ice which melted from the sparks from the south. The power of the darkness gave life to the dripping ice, and the first giant was born, and was named Emir. The ice continued to drip, and the power of the void gave life to it, and it became a cow whose milk fed the giant. That's right, a cow, but you weren't expecting that. <laughs> It's dangerous. Don't open the gate. Don't, don't. She's done it. Okay. It's so dark. It's so dark. It's dark. The dark. Only the dead may cross. Only the dead may cross into hell. No one here but me. Not you. Did you think that I would let you go? That you lost me back in the wilds? I will never let you go. You can't get rid of me. I am your shadow. And I will be watching when you draw your last dying gasp. I'm not ready to die. You will be when you see what they did to your dear beloved. Come true. 
truth. You searched for control. A way to pull through. When you were in love, you left him in tears. To smother your furies. And banish your fears. But in darkness they came. Through stormy black seas they raided these shores. Do you still hear his screams? And now, that you're home, he's so far away. They've taken his soul. To these gods you cannot pray. They can break you, but not your promise. Even death won't keep you apart. Through his darkness you will find him in your sword still beats a heart. You fought for love unspoilt by your darkness within. You fought for your dreams. Now there's no way to win. In the head of his corpse lies the seat of his soul. So you must carry his vessel to bring him back home. won't allow it. So you will walk into the lair of the beast. Look it in the eye. And you will go to war. This is your mission. This is your quest. There is nothing else for it. Why, Sergeant Pass? 
when there is a new road ahead. The only one that makes any sense. I don't even know how to dodge that thing. She so changes his angle.
Symbols I need to find. The journey to Helheim is never a straight one. Each must find their own path. Align yourself to its secrets, and you will find yours. There's one symbol. Alright. Had a feeling there would be something in there. There's still two more seals, though. However you come to the gold-covered bridge that leads to Hell, you may find it guarded by a giantess. She will ask your name. She will ask your lineage. She will ask your business. The Northmen tell of the warrior woman Brynhild, who leapt into fire and rode to Hell to join her slain love Sigurd, and is challenged by the giantess.
be something out here. another door. Door that I cannot get through. I figured that would count as the symbol. Or do I gotta do it from over here? The symbol's literally right there. See? see the symbol. It's like if I'm at the entrance here. Is there a way up? Like a ladder or something I can take? It's just the angle it doesn't want me looking at it. Feels like there's something I'm missing. I feel like it's over here somewhere.
found a way to get those stairs down. There's the symbol right there. Like, it should just accept me doing this, right? You'd think. I see how to get the symbols, I just don't know how to get up. there somehow. I see. Okay. Figured it out. Put the stairs together. to do it on a specific spot, even though I saw it, like, several times, even from below. There we go. All the symbols have been taken care of. possesses large dwelling places in Helheim. Tall are her walls, high are her gates. The name of her dish is hunger. Her knife is famine. On her threshold all will stumble. Her bed is called sick bed, and her bed hangings are called flames of a funeral pyre. They say she is easy to recognize, half black, and half the color of flesh, and her face, menacing and grim. All right.
song again. Is it? Is it? Is it? Tell her. Yes. The source of the darkness. It's coming. This is your moment. I'm sorry. What? I can't watch this. What are you doing? You're showing weakness. You're not a warrior. You're a disgrace. The gods will punish you for this. Pick up the sword. Pick it up. Fight the darkness. Fight it. Get up. Get up. Get up and fight. Stormy seas and lost souls. She's dreamt of this before. They say dreams are visions of our memories, thoughts and fears, as seen by our inner eye. But what if each one of us is always dreaming, even when awake, and we only see what our inner eye creates for us? Is this what hell is? A world shaped by Senua's nightmares? Maybe that's why people feared seeing the world through our eyes. Because if you believe that Senua's reality is twisted, you must accept that yours might be too. You fail the gods. You're pathetic. Rotten. Cursed. What were you thinking? Did you really think you could win? How stupid can you be? Everyone hates her. She's a curse. Look at you. A warrior. Worthless. Weak. Pathetic. Go on. Feel sorry for yourself. Because there is no one left to do that for you. Take it. If you're too much of a coward to fight, then end the suffering. Oh. Broken and lost. Just Do like it. your sword. Do it. Come on. Guess I'll be needing a new sword. Why go on? And you give everything and face that which torments you. Only to find that it is worse than you could have imagined. Why go on? Is it really so weak to ask this? Or are we just so afraid of the honest answer that we do not dare pose the question? Sometimes the answer lies in a memory. A feeling. A song. Okay, I guess we got Dillion in our head now too. 